All right, guys. So I wanted to do um, a training video on how to um, withdraw your funds um, straight into your bank account using Coinbase. Uh, typically, when you're a Forex trader and you withdraw from your broker account into Coinbase, um, the Bitcoin is going to come into your Coinbase and then you'll have to sell the Bitcoin. And then when you sell the Bitcoin, however much Bitcoin that you sold is going to transfer into cash. The however much cash you have there, then you could transfer it to your bank account. So I want to show you guys how to do that because it's a little bit complicated at first, but once you get it, it's a little bit easy. So if you don't have Coinbase, then you can sign up here. Just create an account, put in your information, sign up here, and then basically create an account. But I'm going to go ahead and log in. So when you log in, they're going to send you a verification code to your phone. So then you put it in. So this is going to help you to verify your account. So then they're going to basically, normally they send you an email uh, to send you a, a new device confirmation to your email. So then you have to go to your email and click authorize this computer. And that's what's going to allow you to get inside of your account. Now, let's say, uh, like in the, uh, the la uh, in the last video that I recorded, let's say you um, got your Bitcoin address. So we're going to find that. So let's go here to Bitcoin. So what we want to do is we want to get the Bitcoin address. So we're going to go to wallet. So let's say you wanted to receive uh, the Bitcoin, right? So let's click here. So this is the Bitcoin wallet address that you would use um, to put right here. So when you're in your back office of Eagle FX and you click withdraw, and then you put in the USD that you want to, um, you know, the currency you want to withdraw with, and then you put the amount of $200. It's going to take you to this screen, and it's going to say enter the address you want to send the $200 or the $550 or whatever, how much money you want to send. Notice here it says Bitcoin address. Well, that's where you would enter this address because you're trying to receive that Bitcoin to Coinbase from EgoFX, which is your broker. Makes sense? So then you would click copy and then you would paste it right here. That's what's going to happen when you click withdraw and then you click the withdraw button. On the next screen, it's going to show this. Paste that address, click send Bitcoin. And then however long it takes to send that Bitcoin to your Coinbase, I don't know, it just depends, but you're going to get a notification from Coinbase. Once that happens, then it's going to show in your Bitcoin overview. It's going to show right here. Uh, matter of fact, uh, go to portfolio. It's going to show up right here. So then you click here and then you look at the overview. And so it's going to show you the amount that you have in there. So it's going to show up uh, actually right here. So Bitcoin balance, however much of Bitcoin, which equals how much? So let's say it's two hundred dollars. It's going to show you how much amount of uh, Bitcoin you have, how much Bitcoin you have, which is two dollars worth. I'm trying to explain. Sorry. So then what you're going to do is you're going to click sell. So let's say you sent two hundred dollars worth of Bitcoin from your broker. It's going to show up here. So then you want to sell Bitcoin and then deposit the cash. So basically you're converting Bitcoin into cash. So you type in $200 and then you're going to preview the sell. Now, of course, I can't do it because I don't have $200 in here. But then basically it's going to confirm, basically it's going to confirm it for you. And then you're going to sell it. And then what's going to happen is then we'll go back to the portfolio. You want to click on U.S. dollar. Then the balance is going to show $200. All 
All right, so now you have $200 of US money. Then what you're going to do is you're going to click deposit. Now, I don't have no money in, in, in here yet, but you're going to click deposit. It basically is going to preview the transaction, how much you're going to transfer to your bank, and then basically you click deposit. And then it's going to let you know, hey, it's going to take 24 to 78 hours to deposit the $200 into your bank account. All right. So when you're setting up um, your payment method, um, let me see. Give me a second here. Um, let me go on to the home page. So when you're setting up your withdrawal method, um, when you set up your withdrawal method, it's going to give you, and, and this is this is the deposit part, but it's the same thing with the withdrawal. It's going to give you the option to add a new account, and you can select bank account or wire transfer. I recommend bank account. And then uh, you're going to click continue. You're going to select your bank. And then when you select your bank, that's when you put in your username and password for uh, your banking information. And then you submit it. And then it's going to link your banking information to your Coinbase. So whenever you withdraw cash or funds um, from your, um, when you, um, Withdraw your, your cash to your bank account after selling your selling your Bitcoin into cash. Then it's going to transfer your funds straight to your bank account. So that's typically how you can withdraw uh, funds from your broker account into your Coinbase. And then your Coinbase, sell your Bitcoin. So that way you can exchange Bitcoin for dollars and then withdraw the dollars into your bank account. So I hope this video helps. I wanted to make this as easy as possible because it's very hard to understand at first. This is just one of the ways you can do it. Uh, so if you have any more questions or concerns, don't hesitate to call me or text me at 770-558-0777. Talk to you soon. Bye.